Shadim. My dear brothers and sisters, my dear children, we're still in this, we are still in the series that I have started uh, talking about the relevant issues to the end of the year and to what's so called the holidays, and we're remembering the uh, story of Isa alayhi salam from the Quran and the previous khutbah, those who are following my khutbah on the YouTube, I talked about the, uh, the ayah from the Surah Ali Imran, which the mighty Allah Azza says, Inna Allah astafa Adam wa Nuhan wa ala Ibrahim wa ala Imran ala al-alamin dhurriyatan ba'duha min ba'din wa Allahu sami'un alim. How Allah Azza wa have selected and chosen Adam alayhi salam being the father of all humanity and chosen Nuh alayhi salam the second father of humanity and how Allah Azza have chosen Ibrahim the father of the prophets that have came from onwards after him and how Allah Azza wa have included Ali Imran and what's the connection between uh, uh, Ali Imran and Musa ibn Imran and how Allah Azza wa concluded this ayah by saying, Wallahu Sami'un Alim. Sami'un to your dua as a parent, Alimun about your actions as a muttaqi that will reflect on the life of your children. As Allah has illustrated to us that the dua or your dua to your children, your dua to Allah Azza wa Habli min al salihin and your dua that Allah Azza will give you uh, uh, the the risala dhikrin fil akhirin is as a result of your devotion uh, in your dua to Allah Azza as it happened in the case of Yahya Zakariya alayhi salam id nada rabbahu nida'an khafiya and it is also as a result of the actions فَلَمَّا اَعْتَزَلَهُمْ وَمَا يَعْبُدُونَ مِن دُونِ اللَّهِ وَهَبْنَا لَهُ إِسْحَاقَ وَيَعْقُوبَ وَكُلًّا جَعَلْنَا نَبِيًّا وَجَعَلْنَا لَهُمْ وَهَبْنَا لَهُمْ مِنْ رَحْمَتِنَا وَجَعَلْنَا لَهُمْ لِسَانَ صِدْقٍ عَلِيًّا As a result of the sacrifice that Ibrahim alayhi salam did in his life as a da'i to the deen of Allah Azza wa Jalla, Allah blessed him and honored him and gave him the children Ishaq wa Yaqub wa kullan ja'alna nabiyya wa ja'alna lahum lisana sadaqin aliyya and they had, they had they, their, their message their, their message continued afterwards and concluded from the chain of, of Ishaq by Isa alayhi salam being the seal of the prophets from the chain of Ishaq and then where uh, Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam was sent to be the last and the final the messenger messengers of Allah azza wa jal so with this we kind of get an idea what is the responsibility of the parents. Your responsibility relies in being devout in your dua to Allah Azza wa for your children. Be like Yahya, be like Ibrahim alayhi salam, wa min dhurriyati la yanalu ahli al-dhalimeen, wa yirfa Ibrahim al-qawaida min al-bayti wa ismail, rabbana taqabbal minna, rabbana wabath minhum rasoolan yatlu alayhim ayatika. The dua, as the Prophet ﷺ indicated, that I am the, dua, the da'wah, the response of the da'wah of my father Ibrahim alayhi salam. So this this what have made this usra, the family of Imran, be recognized. And this is how Allah Azza wa Jal have honored uh, the, this family in, in the Qur'an. And as Allah Azza wa Jal afterwards in Surah Maryam, which is the chapter that honors the Maryam alayhi salam being the mother of, of, of Isa alayhi salam from the Rusul of Ul Azm, from the, the mighty prophets of Allah Azza wa Jal. How Allah Azza wa illustrated in this chapter. Furthermore, the ayat that Allah Azza demonstrated in the birth of Isa alayhi salam and in his life. And how Allah Azza wa in this chapter also illustrate further the, the story of Zakaria alayhi salam. How Allah Azza wa Jal have heard his dua, Rabbi inni wa hana al-azmu minni wa ishta'al al-ra'su shayban wa lam akum bi duaika Rabbi shaqiyya wa inni khiftu al-mawaliya min warai wa kanat mra'ati aakhiran fahabli min ladunka waliya. How his dua and his devotion in ibadah to Allah Azza wa Jal and how his actions also in ibadah wa aslah la lahu zawjahu as illustrated in Surah Al-Anbiya afterwards إِنَّهُمْ كَانُوا يُسَارِعُونَ فِي الْخَيْرَاتِ وَيَدْعُونَنَا رَغَبًا وَرَهَبًا وَكَانُوا لَنَا خَاشِعِينَ 
how as a result of their devotion in ibadat and as a result of their dua to Allah Azza wa and as a result of their khushur in their in their ibadah to Allah Azza wa Jal, Allah Azza wa Jal, innahum kanu sari'oon fil khayrati, not ila al khayrati, but within the khayrat competing with those who around them in the in the in the in the in the khayrat towards Allah Azza wa Jal. As a result of that, Allah responded to them. And offered to them Yahya, Ya Yahya, Khudil Kitaba, Bikuat and Wa Ataina, who shook Masabia, Wahanan and Miladuna was a cat and Wakana Takia, Wabara, be well a day, he will make a Jabbar and Asiya, was Salam Alehi, O my Wolida, Way O my Wood, Way O my Batu Haya. Allah Akbar, look to the power of Duha, look to the power of the good deeds, to the Taqwa of Allah Azza wa in your life. Look to the taqwa what have resulted in, 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 in Allah Azza wa giving to Zakaria a child. Ya Yahya, khudhi al-kitaba biquwatin wa atainahu al-hukma sabiyya. Allah Azza wa have given him the wisdom, the hikmah early in his life. Wa hananan min ladunna and on the top of that as a result of what his parents have done. For both of them, of yusari'una fil khayrati wa yad'unana ra'aban wa rahaban. Allah has given them a child that is وحنان من لدنا. Hanan is mercy. Hanan is rahmah. Hanan is what we wish, wish to find in, in our children and what the children seek refuge for in their parents. When a child is, is it, when the child is so vulnerable, they run to the comfort of their own mothers. And once the, mom, the mothers welcome them and shower and, and, and hug them, Give them the hanan, give them the rahmah, give them the comfort that they need that nurtures their, their emotions so they become decent individuals later on in the, in the future. And vice versa, those who are missing the hanan early in their life most likely would, be, would, be, would grow up with difficulties and challenges in their adulthood. And this is the correlation between the warmth and the hanan and the rahmah in the family versus the missing of the rahmah and hanan in the family and that's why the prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam said that i am with the sponsors of the orphan like this in the jannah so that everyone will be giving the hanan the comfort the rahmah to the orphan even if they have missed their own parent or their own their, the one who provides the rahmah for them and that's why the prophet said if you feel the cruelty in your part in your heart Wipe over out of rahmah on the head of the yateen. Wahananan min ladunna, not any hanan, but it's from Allah Azza wa Jal. Wa zakatan. Zakatan is a purity. Khul hal laka ila an tazakka wa ahdiyaka ila rabbika fataksha. As Allah has mentioned in the Quran when he said to Musa and sent him to Fir'aun, ask him to purify himself and to, for purification. Allah Azza wa Jal had blessed Yahya, the child of Zakaria alayhi salam, of being Hananan min ladunna wa zakatan. Allah purified him. Allah had supplemented him and, and, and gave him the moral values that would make him unique and different in his interactions with, his, with, the, with the people around him. And he was conscious. He was muttaqi to Allah in the practical understanding of taqwa. Taqwa is not only of dressing in a certain way or showing people that you are muttaqi in, a certain, in certain actions. Taqwa is what's in the conscience. Taqwa is what builds in the back of your mind as parameters that would prevent you from intrinsic acting against the hudud of Allah Azza wa Jal, not only when you're in public, but when you are by yourself with, uh, and, and, and no one can see you. وَبَرًّا بِوَالِدَيْهِ وَكَانَ تَقِيَّةً وَالسَّلَامُ عَلَيْهِ يَوْمَ وُلِدَ وَيَوْمَ يَمُوتُ وَيَوْمَ يُبْعَثُ حَيَّةً SubhanAllah, look into this. Surah Maryam that explains what have come in Surah Ali Imran and illustrates it further in more details and portray a beautiful image to the beauty of being muttaqi, to being da'i, to being a musari' al khayrat to Allah Azza wa Jal. Come to explain for you different stories. The story of, of Zakaria with his son Yahya, 
and then comes and further details the story of Maryam alayhi salam wadkur fil kitab Maryam idha intabadat min ahliha makanan sharqiyya fa arsalna ilayha ruhana fa tamathala laha basharan sawiyya and then after the story of Maryam alayhi salam Allah has to just mention you know the story of Ibrahim in how he was a and how the salah of the child have resulted a salah of 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 Ibrahim alayhi salam an interaction with his own father who was not Muslim. Ya abati, ya abati, ya abati. How he communicated with him out of respect and love. His kindness and birr to his father who was not Muslim have resulted afterwards for Allah Azza wa Jal to give him Ishaqa wa Yaquba wa kullan ja'alna nabiyya. Keep that in mind. Keep that in mind as we're living in an environment where we're seeing our children going astray, where we're seeing the uquq wal billah that is demonstrated in a very ugly way. When you go to the senior homes, and when you get to when you go to the aftercare, the, 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 the senior care places, you will see something that you break break your heart. Where, where, where is the rahma? Where is where is the, the care? Where is, where is what Allah has have created in, in the hearts of a human being? It's all gone. It's vanished. It's vanished as a result of the cruel and cold environment and culture that we have created to ourselves. We're not criticizing Western societies. Because unfortunately, this is a global syndrome. This is a global problem. What is happening here, it's happening also in Muslim, in Muslim countries. So when you go back, we need to go back to the source. We need to go back to, to understand how we can re, 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 revive and how can we create the hanan, the mawadda, the rahma in the hearts of our children by having families that are full of rahma and hanan and mawadda. Allah Azza wa Jal spoke about Isa alayhi salam how Isa, early in his life, when he was still baby, a newborn, a few hours born baby, gave a khutbah that demonstrated his life, demonstrates for others around him and for people to come how they should be living their life, and denouncing those who claim something different about Isa alayhi salam. قالوا كيف نكلم من كان في المهد صبيا قال إني عبد الله أتاني الكتاب وجعلني نبيا وجعلني مباركا أينما كنت وأوصاني بالصلاة والزكاة ما دمت حيا وبرا بوالدتي ولم يجعلني جبارا شقيا والسلام علي يوم ولدت ويوم أموت ويوم أبعث حيا ذلك عيسى بن مريم قول الحق الذي فيه يختلف ما كان لله أن يتخذ من ولدا سبحانه إذا قضى أمرا فإنما يقول له كن فيكون الله أكبر beautiful set of ayat in a beautiful chapter addresses the concept of توحيد addresses the concept of تقوى addresses the moral values that we need to be abiding in in our life the first thing he uttered and said is إني عبد الله I am not Billah, the son of Allah. I am not a god myself. I am the servant of Allah Azza wa Jal. Subhanallah, the Asra bi Abdihi, Layla in the Masjid al Harami and Masjid al Wa'ibad al Rahman, the Ladina Yamshun al Abdi Hawda. It's an honorary title to be a servant of Allah Azza wa Jal. Inni Abdullah, the servant of Allah. Period. This is it. This is it. No more, no less. Allah created Isa alayhi salam in an ayah. As Jibreel responded to Maryam when she said, Anna yakunu li walad wa lam yamsasni bashar wa lam aku baghiya. Kala kathalika kala rabbiku huwa alayya hayr. Wal naj'alahu ayatan lil nasi wa rahmatan minna wa kana amran maqdiyya. Allah has made the birth of Isa as an ayah, 
as you have created Adam without a parent, without parents, and how and as he created Hawa, the wife of Adam from Adam alayhi salam, uh, 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 with, uh, with, with a parent without a mother, and how he have created Isa alayhi salam from a mother without a father to show the diversity in the power and ability of the mighty Allah Azzawajal in his creation because simply he would say to things be and they would be and that's why when we make dua to Allah Azzawajal we remember the demonstration of Rahmati Rabbika Abdahu Zakariya Allah Azzawajal demonstrated to us his Rahmah in Abdahu Zakariya how we the Zakariya have become an example of the rahmah of Allah Azza wa Jal, how at an old age with with soft bones and with gray hair and with 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 weakness Allah gave him ulam and zakiya never give up never give up the in 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 your dua and the trust in the power of Allah Azza wa Jal wa ayatan minna wa 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 rahmatan lil nas wa kana amran maqdiya the birth of Isa the the existence of Isa and the livelihood of a human at his time was Rahmah. As the Mufassir indicated, Isa alayhi salam did not come to the cream of the crop of Bani Israel. His followers and Hawariyin were the average, the public, those who were living, they're, 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 they're the, 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 the below average individuals when they met Isa alayhi salam, they were inspired. They're, 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 his 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 presence in their life changed them to become afterwards Hawariyin, the followers and supporters of Isa alayhi salam. And his presence once again, when he comes back again, as we believe as Muslimin that he will be coming once again, will be also rahmatan to the entire mankind. He will be spreading the deal of Allah Azzawajal and enforcing the concept of Tawheed. Inni Abdullah Atani al-Kitab declared in the past before my, my birth that I will be given the book at Tawrah and he declared and ordained for me from before early before even my birth I'm going to be a Nabi a prophet of Allah Azza wa Jal not any prophet but prophet from the Ulil Azam the mighty prophet Allah Azza wa Jal وَجَعَلَنِي مُبَارَكًا أَيْنَمَا كُنْتْ Allahu Akbar I wish we're able to understand the advice, the, the, the uh, recommendation, the words of Isa when he was still baby, a few hours born baby. We miss that, my brothers and sisters. We have come materialistic individuals or beings, or maybe I should say machines. We only do when we have a good done to us. We only do when we evaluate things in our mind and think and believe that we're getting something out of what we do. We have forgotten something called ma'roof. We have forgotten something called mawadda. We have forgotten something that is called khayr. We've forgotten something that is called birr that is gone from our agenda. We become possessed with the materialistic lifestyle of the culture we're living in. We think only about work and money. We discarded values. We discarded what it means to be a person Mubarak. Aynama kunt, wherever I am. Not only in the masjid interacting with my Muslim fellows, your interactions with everyone around you, wherever you are, should be full of barakah and spilling the barakah on. When Al Mut'im ibn Hadi, the son of Al Mut'im, Al Adi ibn Mut'im, I'm sorry, when, when he came after the battle of Uh Badr to, to communicate with the Prophet وسلم, about the captive in the battle, he listened to the Quran recited by the Prophet وسلم, and the long story short, he embraced Islam as a result of recitation of the Quran. And then the Prophet said to him, He's the son of Al Mut'im. 
the one who gave amnesty to the Prophet ﷺ when he came back from a Ta'if. He was not Muslim, but though he accepted to give the refugee the amnesty to the Prophet ﷺ when he asked for it. And he took his children with the full gear of, gear of war, with their swords and their protect, with their, with their shields, and they protected the Prophet ﷺ walking between them. And said to the people of Mecca around the Kaaba, Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is under my amnesty, my amnesty, my protection. No one was able to touch the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. He said to him, if al mutam is to be here, present with you, I would have given him those al uh, 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 al antaf meaning referring to the kuffar who were captive as a result of his good his own good deeds to me when i was in verbal situation then that there is nothing for us to prevent us from doing birr and kindness and baraka actions to those who are around us from the non-muslim society in which we're living in when you're driving down the street and someone stops you at the red light asking for a change don't roll back don't roll up your window and give them that look if you happen to be walking in the street and someone walks by you asking for a change don't give them that dirty like they're human being like yourself you don't know what have led them to be in the position they are in you don't know what circumstances have pushed them to live this lifestyle no one wishes to live in the street no one wishes wishes to live this dirty lifestyle be a person who like Isa alayhi salam will meet someone who is who is completely jabbar asi and then offer words become rahma becomes a person who 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 who, who, who is the khair will be flowing from him to others around him be kind be generous reach out to your bucket because وفي أموالهم حق للسائر والمحروم not معلوم as it is in the zakah concept but in أموالهم حق للسائر والمحروم give them even if it's a quarter even if it's a loony whatever you can reach and afford give it to them with the intention you want to be from the muhsineen with the intention you want this sadaqa to reach that person to touch his life say to him my brother you are my brother I'm giving you this because I care about you. Buy something to eat with it. Take care of yourself. Give him kind words. Give him something that will make him that someone cares about me. Someone actually looked at me with the eyes of Rahmah, even though I am, you know, living this lifestyle, even though my home is on the street under the or the bus stop or somewhere else. Even though my clothes are filthy, even though I have been showered for so long, even though I look very dirty, someone cares about me. That eyes of rahmah, that eye of care, could be inshallah purpose for the hidayah of someone, a human being, to save him from the hellfire of Allah Azza wa Jalla. mubarakan, aynama kunt, wherever I am. وأوصاني بالصلاة والزكاة ما دمت حيا to be continued إن شاء الله in the series of talk in the time we remember Isa عليه السلام as the society around us remembers Isa in a different perspective وأقول قولي هذا واستغفر الله لي ولكم واستغفروا استغفر الله مستغفر الله الحمد لله الحمد لله نحمده ونستعينه ونستهديه ونستغفره ونعوذ بالله من شرور انفسنا وسيئات اعمالنا من يهده الله فهو المهتد ومن يضلل فلن تجد له وليا مرشدا ان الله وملائكته يصلون على النبي يا ايها الذين امنوا صلوا عليه وسلموا تسليما اللهم صل على سيدنا محمد وعلى ال سيدنا محمد كما صليت على سيدنا ابراهيم وعلى ال سيدنا ابراهيم وبارك اللهم على سيدنا محمد وعلى ال سيدنا محمد كما باركت على سيدنا ابراهيم في العالمين انك حميد مجيد اللهم إني عبيدك أبناء عبيدك أبناء إيمانك يا رب نواصينا يا رب بيدك مواطن يا رب فينا حكمك عدل يا رب فينا قضاءك 
نسألك بكل اسم هو لك سميته به أحسن أنزلته في كتابك أو علمته أحدا من خلقك أو استأثرت به في علم الغيب عندي بها لأن تجعل القرآن العظيم ربيع قلوبنا يا رب اللهم اجعله جناء لنومنا وأحزن لنا يا رب الرحيم اللهم اهدنا واجعلنا سببا لمن اهتدى يا رب العالمين اللهم أسألك من رحمتك ومنك وجودك وكرمك علينا بأن تهدنا وتهدي أبنائنا واجعلنا بارين بآبائنا وارزقنا بر أبنائنا في حياتنا وبعد مماتنا ربنا هب لنا من أزواجنا وذرياتنا قرة أعين واجعلنا للمتقين إماما ربي أوزعنا نشكر نعمتك التي أنعمت علينا وعلى والدي يا رب وأن أعمل صالحا ترضاه وأصلح لي في ذريتي إني تبت إليك وإنني من المسلمين وصلى الله على سيدنا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه اجمعين واقم الصور